<laughs> so first day out what you want to do you can't hold a real one down too long okay <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I look a mess, but guess what? I'm out of quarantine, baby. But you know what? What I'm about to do is take my vitamin C for today. I'm out running errands and stuff or whatever. Um, I'm at the gas station. Y'all, pumping gas is so fucking ghetto. It's ghetto as fuck. Like, I can't wait to get me a boyfriend so I can boss him around and be like, baby. Baby, go fill my car up or I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but anyways, y'all, it is a day where I need to put my wig on. So y'all are going to see me looking crazy before that. Y'all, it's crazy as fuck out here. Y'all know I just had coronavirus. I still do. But I've been hand sanitizing. But as you, when you get diagnosed and test positive for coronavirus, you come less and less um, contagious to other people. But you still want to still take precautions. Um, so yeah, but I'm still, I don't know. Keisha want to go to, go get hookah tomorrow. Tomorrow's Friday. Today is only Thursday. It's a little bright, bright. Hold on. Today's only Thursday. But I'm like, I don't know, cause I'm scared, y'all. I really need to um get this surgery. And I don't yeah, y'all are asking me, were asking me in my last video, am I still getting surgery? Bitch, there yes, hair doctor has to tell my doctor that I'm good to go. So hold on one second. questions about my surgery i'm still gonna get it baby like i'm still gonna get the body like i'm still gonna get right and yeah so but what am i gonna do oh so i'm vlogging i guess for the weekend so we'll see what what it do um i hope this is not blurry i look so pale y'all it's been so sunny outside but y'all know i've been in the house since um October 3rd no I'm just kidding June something like June something is now July 10th I've been in the house it's been so sunny outside y'all but this is like my second day outside so first day out what you want to do you can't hold a real one down too long okay but um yeah so I need to run my errands I'm about to go to Ulta because I want to get the t3 curling iron Aaliyah J uh not Aaliyah J Aaliyah um uses that flat iron so it looks like it curls really good and this other um stylist that I watch on YouTube he uses it too he said it's like the best one and she said it's really good so I'm gonna go get that from Ulta because I want my curls to be popping because I'm about to put a wig on tonight so yeah y'all probably will have seen that wig me wearing that wig in the first couple clips because yeah so anyway so um yeah so uh, and what else did i have to tell y'all uh, what else did i have to say oh that's what i had to say fuck that nigga no i'm just kidding <laughs> Oh, it's 12.48. It's 2.12. He don't need a text back. But anyways, let me um put my seatbelt on. I'm about to run my errands. I really don't want to keep my camera right here because it be falling. And 
plus this car is making a little bit too much noise i cannot wait to get my new car because this is just not it i be getting rentals and shit well me and my sister we will alternate rentals because so we both need a new car <laughs> well this sounds horrible i'm gonna talk to y'all later hey y'all i'm back home now um it's fucking raining so bad like oh my god the lights just went off and on i think i'm gonna leave my lamp over there did i used to have it over there yeah i did anyway but let me show y'all a little haul actually i'm gonna do this downstairs one second hey 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 okay anyway i gotta get to work I feel like I just took a nap, but I really didn't. I was literally just chilling. But let me show y'all my beauty supply store and Ulta. Huh. Okay. Don't mind my hair. Thank you. So first we're gonna go to Ulta. Uh y'all, like when I was in Ulta, I was getting very much racist vibes. It was all white people. I went to the one in the white neighborhood. Y'all, this is scary. But anyways, so I went to the one in like the white area, like whatever. So I got the T3. I wanted to try this out for y'all to see how I like it because I am not a good curler when it comes to like, I'm trying to learn how to flat iron, I mean curl. Hence, I burned myself on the one I was currently using and I had got that one from Target. So I wanted to try this one out. I caught this on sale. This is on sale, y'all. So make sure y'all cop it. I'll link it down below. So yeah, I got it for $120, but it's only okay. $120. Bitch, if the lights go out, I don't even know what to say. So then I got some more of my favorite exfoliants. Um, this is what I use to exfoliate my body. This tree hut, and I never smelt the vanilla bean. I ain't wanna open it and smell it because too many, ooh, this smells good as fuck. I'm doing this tonight. So, yeah. That smells good as fuck. And then I just got some, I never tried this before. This is their, this must be their new lip scrub. And y'all, my lips been like extra crusty, especially since I've been in quarantine. Um, this, what the fuck? This window's open, I should close it, obviously. But, um, sugar lips for date. And then, um, so yeah. Ooh, bitch, I'm scared. Y'all, I'm literally sweating, like, cause I'm scared, I'm scary. Y'all, I literally live in the middle of no fucking where, seriously. See, I be hearing shit. Mm -mm. I know y'all heard that shit. Anyway, anyway, like I was saying, um. So, anyway, from the beauty supply store, I got the Just Five. This is the best hair dye, y'all. Get this in jet black, it will dye your hair. Black is F in five minutes, I swear. Then I just got some wig caps because they were sending me some, some dark ass wig. And then I just got some gloves for when I bleach my knots. And then also I picked up this a vitamin E body oil because y'all this whole month I'm basically preparing for next month so um yeah so basically I got vitamin E because I want my incision scars to be healed so I got some vitamin E oil I'm gonna try this on my body just in general anyway after I exfoliate matter of fact so yeah so so yeah, 
Um, so I'm about to get to work on my wig. And oh, and I also got a new baby hair thing. So, but yeah. And I got, oh my God. Mm -mm. Y'all, my heart just dropped. Uh-uh, I'm going back in my room. I can't be out here in the open because I don't know what's gonna pop up out of me, out of nowhere. I'm gonna just leave this shit right here. And okay. Hey y'all, it's the next day. I have the same thing on because I'm about to go run and get my eyebrows done real quick because they need to be cleaned up. I'm about to get the same thing I had last time, the tint. And y'all was like, oh my God, is that a beauty supply store? Yes, I get my eyebrows done at a beauty supply store. But, and also, I'm about to drop these wigs off. I am so, I sold these wigs just because I'm not going to have time to put them on because this month is really like me getting ready for my surgery and then I have to do other collabs and i just wanted to sell these because i don't have no time to put them on so and they were sent to me so i'm like i'm gonna sell them because i can't put them on so those are what i have to do so yeah i do have wig sales y'all so they sell really quick so y'all gotta get on it y'all will be like oh my god um is that still available i'm like no that shit sold like the blonde one really sold within like 30 minutes and then the black one took like an hour but yeah like i'm saying and i'll be selling them for the plug too because like and these are brand new and i feel like the blonde one i sold for cheap i sold it for like 350 and it's pre-plucked and it's uh like it was custom made basically and then the other one it's brand new too i sold it for like 250 so but yeah so i'm about to be on my way to do that and then get my eyebrows done and then yeah so don't mind my empty closet in the background i'm doing like a whole closet clean out i'm not recording it or nothing i just need to go through my closet because that railing right there girl let me show you girl it's broke like it's gonna break it's crazy see it it's crazy but yeah we have to clean that out but anyway let me go because i gotta hurry up good morning y'all it's the next day i got my eyebrows done they're a little bit more intense but i like them because i don't have to do that much with my eyebrows and they're, they're like perfect they're like that ombre shape and i think she used henna or something they're really itchy but i just put some oil on them so but yeah girl we got a full schedule today but yeah girl i'm about to be busy today um i just got home from work i had to work this morning i had to get up at 3 a.m but work doesn't stop because i have to do film a video today put my wig on obviously cornrows and um what else i gotta do oh and i gotta take a picture but i might not post it today i might just take them today but post them tomorrow but it depends i don't know if they fire i'm gonna be like uh i want them up now oh my god my brows look so good make sure y'all go check out kayla and put her instagram right here on the screen same girl that did my eyebrows the last time but she really wanted to go in this time and she was like um she was like do you are you sure because you normally i don't really want her to go in because i don't want that boxy look but they don't look boxy at all they just look faded and that's what i like that's what she knows but yeah so i'm going to right now it's only 10 50 it's gonna be 11 o'clock i'm about to make these pants y'all okay so i look i don't know why people call me like it be fake pages they be like replica queen like girl all my fucking bags and accessories are real like you got me fucked up but i do love a replica i do love a betty on a budget moment so that's what we're gonna do today so i'm gonna show y'all the pants i want to remake just because i'm trying to spice it up a little bit let me see these. okay so these are the pants i'm gonna be recreating i think they are so fire Hold on. 
So these are the pants I'm gonna be recreating. They're gonna be so fire. And it, I don't think it will take me that long because it's only one leg. And the stencil that I printed out, it's just all on one thing. Cause when I made my swimsuit, sweatsuit one, it was all individual ones because I wanted it big. But yeah, so. I'm gonna see if I can do that real quick right before I film my video because I gotta film a video today. Obviously, I just said that. But let me take my vitamin C one second. A lot of y'all asked me what did I do um, like while I was recovering from my COVID. Um, y'all drink Pedialyte. I was drinking a lot of Pedialyte and two packs of emergency. Um, what else? Like, I was drinking emergency like every six hours, and then the Pedialyte every six hours, and then I took Elgeberry gummies. I don't have any right now. And then let me show you this other thing. And then I took these. These are, I don't even know how you say this name, but you just put them under your tongue and let them dissolve. And I would take like one every six hours, um, depending on how I was feeling. But you don't want to overdose on these because you don't want to think your body should be dependent on this you know i'm about to take all these fluids right now before i get my little day started show y'all the stencil that I got off the internet so I'm gonna probably put this on I got three different type of ways I can do this I can try to put it on this to iron it on but I don't know if it's gonna work but I can always use a tester and then I got a cardboard box so it doesn't like get soggy because it can get soggy on this paper but I want to see if it comes out right on the cardboard but i don't have time to be cutting out cardboard it's probably gonna take all day but i don't know we'll see then i just got this was <laughs> this is the technique that i used the first time with this paper i just trace it on there and then cut it out so i don't know we'll see what i want to do and then i got some sharpies and then another clear water bottle these are only a dollar at walmart y'all in the bottle section and then what else is going on right now but yeah so i'm about to just do that and yeah so yeah and then i gotta put my wig on i'm super excited because i'm trying to do like a air contain inspired hairstyle y'all see and then um yeah so yeah so let's just get this little project started so i can start putting my wig on because putting my wig on is a fucking process fucking process y'all so this took longer than what i anticipated but i just cut out the stencil so basically i'm gonna just trace it and you know do that but i'm gonna practice it on this one first just to see how it's gonna look but yeah y'all see the finish outcome in the next clip if i even do it <laughs> y'all so the paint the pants girl i like just did some shit y'all i'm literally trying to oh i look a mess right now i'm literally trying to mentally prepare myself to film this fucking video because i hate doing sit downs i love doing sit downs but then i hate them i hate them because this shit is a fucking process and obviously it's just me in my little room and 
I don't, that's why when I move, I really want a two bedroom just so I can have that studio space already set up. Because girl, I have my clothing rack right here, dresser, little desk. That's what I use to film my videos. I put all my stuff um, on my desk, but I have to always rotate it, put my lights up, and then I want this to be my background. So I have to move that fucking thing over there just to put it right here so it can be in front of this i gotta set up my lights and just uh -huh. it's just a fucking process every time i film a fucking sit down video like oh like it's such a process like i don't even give a fuck if i get a picture today as long as my wig is installed and i have the first part of the video and yeah but well the video yeah i can just whatever i don't know i don't know i'm just trying to mentally my bear stuff i got my i got all day i don't need to rush or do anything but still like this shit sucks so yeah but you know what if you like an upcoming youtuber like me like it's this is just what I have to deal with until I move and get the space that I want. Everything is always a process. It's never an overnight thing. Like, you just gotta grow. You know, it's levels to the shit for real. So, I just cannot wait to have my own space. And just be able to just, you know, have everything already set up. All I gotta do is press record. And good to go. But... This is what I have to deal with for right now. So, yeah, let me get my life together because I look crazy. At least let me put my wig on. But, yeah, I'm going to show y'all the everything. I'm not going to record myself moving that damn table because it's going to be, I'm going to look crazy. But, yeah, I'm going to show y'all what I'm talking about once everything is done. I wish it was this speedy of a fucking process. Like, roll the next clip. Right, y'all, so this is basically my little setup. I didn't set up my camera yet, but I'm about to just put everything over here that I'm gonna need for my little install. And y'all see this sit down video before. Y'all see this vlog, so. Oh, and I'm excited to use this glue, y'all. This is the glue Eric and Tay uses. So, I'm going to come back on here once I get done filming, well, installing this wig. I'm going to figure out if I'm going to finish the video today or not, but I probably will. I just got a little headache from that fucking bleach. I need to drink some water. But yeah, I'll check with y'all later. I just got to get this little work done. I'm just really so devastated about those pants. I might have to retry and do a different technique or something. I don't know. Y'all see, I'll show y'all what I did. So y'all, I finished my hair, filmed the little content for Instagram, and I am tired, okay, honey? And tomorrow I'm going to be unboxing all this shit, and I'm gonna show y'all my new bag or whatever. But yeah, y'all, I love my hair so much. It's so fucking cute. So yeah, I'm just about to go to sleep because I gotta work in the morning, and yeah, so. I will see y'all tomorrow. Yeah. Hey girl. It's the next day after next, actually. Let me put some lip gloss on. So, I'm literally going through like a midlife crisis because let me just tell y'all, like over the weekend, um, oh shit. Like over the weekend, and stuff when I see like everybody just like having fun and living their best life on Instagram, it just makes me like feel some type of way. And like, I feel like I'm not living my best life to its fullest potential. And I know we can't really do that right now just because you know, everything that's going on, the pandemic, I'm like getting over my Corona shit. But even before that, like, I feel like I wasn't, living my best life to its fullest potential like i feel like i don't fucking travel well yeah i do. i mean i get the opportunity to travel but i mean i just feel like i'm right now i just feel like i'm not living my best life as i want to 
like i feel like it slowed down and it's so irritating like i know it's probably for a good reason but i just feel like i'm not living my life to its fullest potential and i want i want to so bad but i can't because of everything that's going on and where i live my location like and i'm trying to just stay low key because you know i'm trying to stay healthy and it's just annoying that i be feeling like this like I don't know like good like I just want to live my best life but I can't and then um I can like I just feel like I'm not living my best life and I never like when I see that shit on Instagram I'm like that's what that's what made me love social media so much when um I first started out because looking at other people's lives seeing what they get to do like some of the shit is fake but some of the shit is real so like it's like dope to see that and that's why I love social media and me being from like a small town it's just like damn I can't wait to do that like I can't wait to see what life is like outside of this little ass city you know what I mean like that's what I'm saying like I can't wait to live my best life and I know my time is coming like I know it's coming and I'm tr I'm being patient and I'm just going when it happened I'm gonna soak up every fucking moment of it because all these deaths and stuff is happening rip Naya Rivera from Glee she like I think I don't know what happened but they found her body and then like all these other deaths shootings and stuff happening and it's just like damn you really can't take life for granted and I just really want to live my best life to its like fullest potential. And I feel like right now I just I'm not doing that, and it's mm, it's making me feel some type of way. But I know my time is coming, so I can't really stress about it. But yeah, okay. I know he got some free coffee. <laughs> yeah, I'm outside of Panera. I'm about to get me some soup and yeah because i gotta go back home and i gotta finish uploading this video so i can get approved and then tomorrow i can't wait because i'm gonna start dyeing one of my wigs brown i can't wait but yeah that's another thing and i feel like all i'm doing right now all i've been doing for the last some years um i mean i like traveled and stuff and went to um but i feel like right now all i do is like take pictures for instagram do work work stuff on social media and make videos i mean i love that i love that but i really feel i can't wait to just live fucking life like with no fucking regrets like i just want to do that like man i'm really a small city girl I'm really a small time girl with big city dreams. Like, I just really wanna live my life and do what I'm supposed to do in life, you know? I don't know, I don't know where I'm getting at, but I'm just ranting while I'm waiting on this soup. So, yeah. And um, what was that? What was I gonna say? I forgot. But yeah, that's what I feel like and also i want to tell y'all something but i don't want y'all to be like what the fuck but okay so i'm just gonna tell y'all so basically well nah never mind <laughs> uh, no i'm gonna fucking say it because i really feel like my job really doesn't give a fuck about me they really don't care like I made the decision today that I want to stay quarantined at home like I don't want to go to work right now until I'm fully like until I test negative until I get my negative results from the doctor because I don't want to relapse first of all second of all when i was going through my recovery my job did not call me and see how i was doing nothing when i got back to work only like a couple people asked me how was i doing but like my manager didn't say nothing to me supervisor nothing they wasn't like oh 
doing how you doing like are you sure you want to come back are you sure like they like oh no bitch you okay you said that you okay come your ass back to work like and y'all know i'm trying to get my procedure next month like i'm i'm in this group chat with my doctor i'm on the, i'm in the group and on facebook that's what i mean and um hold on this boy getting off the car and i'm on this group on facebook and i was like oh i tested positive for covid and my surgery is this and this and this date um has anybody has this happened to anybody and this girl was like um they're gonna make you um test once you get there and you need to test negative like they don't take no out-of-state results but i called my doctor's office and told them i was covid positive and they were like you just need to make sure that you're negative and i was like okay i'm gonna get retested once i get my blood work so like all this is stressing me out and my doctor is literally so popping right now y'all he's so fucking popping right now this nigga is booked until next year august next year august 2021 like there's no way like i need to this is what i've been wanting this is something i've been wanting to do for like the longest time it took me a whole year to find my doctor took me a whole conversation and some more and some change to convince my mama to you know support me through this and it's just like it's right there like it's literally right there and i and at the end of the day i need to take care of my own self my health i am deciding that that's what i want to do um first of all this job is literally not my income like it's nothing like literally compared to what i make on you know my social media youtube this is literally fucking chum change like spending money like in a day type shit you know so i'm like it's not worth it four hours no this is not worth it so mm -mm. So let me know if I'm wrong in that situation. I feel like I'm not, but let me know what y'all think. But yeah. So I'm about to give me some tomato soup. Panera got the best tomato soup. It's so good. And oh, I got my nails done, almond shaped. And I just went for like, I've been really into like the French tip style, the white clean. And also, um, I paired my Cartier bracelet with this cute ass. She sent me some more stuff. This is Prissy, everything Prissy. I'm gonna show you the other chains once I get home, once I do like my unboxing. And then, yeah, so that is what's happening right now. So yeah, I'm just, I just need something something I feel like is missing in my life and I just want it to come I know God is like working on it I know he like working on it I know he like girl be patient relax I got you but I'm just like when when so but yeah y'all <sighs> I'm getting hot as fuck but okay I'm gonna probably see y'all once I get home um I don't know if I'm going to do the unboxing tonight or tomorrow. Probably. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. And I got a Fashion Nova. No, actually, I'm going to wait until my other packages come. So, or I can just do it. I don't know. We'll see. I've been ordering so much shit, y'all. I've been losing track of what I got. But anyway, this girl staring at me. But I'll probably talk to y'all once I get home. For sure. Y'all, let me not m bump into his motherfucking fine ass. Damn, he's so fucking fine. Damn. He's fine as hell. <laughs> y'all, I just got done with my soup. And I came home, finished my video. I'm waiting for it to get approved. So I'm watching Black Ink Crew before... I go live and then tonight I'm gonna I gotta schedule my day tomorrow. Oh yeah shit. I gotta um write down everything that I'm gonna do tomorrow. I got a wig to do start. I need to um film a get ready with me and what else I gotta do? I gotta do some more stuff so 
yeah it's gonna be a full day tomorrow um obviously i told john i'm not going to work no more fuck that and um why well, the day off tomorrow anyway so i was gonna do this anyway but yeah and i gotta pick up my room i gotta go through these clothes i really want to just get rid of all of my like i really just want to wear like basic colors very neutral colors and i'm on like a pop of animal print or some type of print but i'm over like everything i'm trying to get a more mature closet you know and i want my like things that pop or whatever but i really just love neutral tones browns and oh my god let me know if there is a black owned company or something where i can get like basics from or and just any type of black owned company list them down below i want to do a black owned company haul soon so yeah but let me finish watching this because i gotta watch him he's so fucking fine y'all like let me bump into this motherfucker let me do not let me bump into this motherfucker i know where he work at i've been there before but he he wasn't there i don't think but maybe i should get a tattoo before i leave i don't know y'all he's so fine oh he fine as fuck <laughs> oh my god y'all so it's the next day i'm about to film a video i'm in my skins and um so what was i gonna say oh so i entered a group i know i don't know if i told y'all this but i entered a group facebook group for my doctor and i told them that i test positive for covid what should i do like how should i flush out because i've been getting like mucus in my throat and um when i started going back to work i fucked up and started drinking coffee again which i should never did but i can have matcha but not coffee so i was messing up on that part and um yeah so i didn't know like so but yeah i have to go on like an alkaline dr cbs cbs um he's like well known for like his natural herbs like um clearing out your body and stuff like that so i'm gonna do that so i can get this covid out of my system because i need to have my surgery because my my fucking surgeon i can't believe like this shit i can't believe he's booked until like next year so i have to test negative like i have to so but yeah so anyway um i'm about to film a video y'all probably see that after this but i'm about to film a video i'm about to put some crimps in my hair and then yeah i might i gotta get a picture tonight i'm gonna take a picture tonight after um but yeah um nothing has been really going on today it's been raining and thunderstorming it's really been killing my mood like i literally took like a three hour nap like i was knocked out can you tell and yeah so but oh my god i cannot wait to show y'all these new slides that i got i'm gonna show y'all once i do like the unboxing part because there's so much i gotta unbox over there but it's so cute but yeah so let me do this real quick and then i'm gonna come back to y'all well i'm gonna check in with y'all i'm gonna check in hey y'all it's the next day ew i know i got these ugly ass glasses on and it makes me oh god it makes me look crazy i need to get some new glasses like asap but i'm in the middle of putting on my wig and yeah last night video was a fail so i'm like you know what i'm just gonna put the fresh wig on so that's what i'm gonna do so i gotta re-record and then last night i went to took pictures y'all and i have a twitter now so you can go ahead and follow me on twitter i'm gonna put that in the description box below and i like it so far i've been talking to y'all like what the fuck but i don't know why i only have 600 followers like where y'all at but it's fine but um anyway so i had said on twitter i was like i took some pics last night and they i took some pics and they were taken in a parking structure and i don't know if y'all know like parking structures have like that crazy ass 3d looking lighting so that's what happened with these pictures let me show y'all they look so fucking they just look too edited and i'm trying to have like different 
type of stuff on my page i'm trying to go for like more of a neutral clean page trying to like like kim kardashian kylie jenner like clean like a clean page and um yeah let me show y'all this shit looks like i barely edited it and it looks so fucking i don't know if y'all can hold on it looks so like it's like popping like there like but it's still cute but it's just like what the fuck like i don't want to look like that so i had posted in um some people were like a couple of my supporters were like um let me see let me see um i wanted to get their opinion that's why i tweeted it and so one of the girls fixed my picture for me and she she was like let me um she was like what are you looking like what type of look are you looking for so i was just i told her i didn't want it to look super edited but i want to be like more neutral and she was like okay let me look at your page and she just basically softened up the photos for me. Let me go to her page. Let me give her, her name is Summer D Beauty. She hooked up my pic. So yeah, she basically just softened the contrast a little bit. Um, But yeah, cause that shit was looking crazy. Well, it wasn't looking crazy, it was just too much. So by the time I post this, y'all have seen um, the pictures but this is what they look like now and I'm gonna post at four o'clock hopefully they do good but anyway so I'm about to just put on my wig and I'm about to watch the fucking challenge um the last time I said that y'all I watched the challenge a couple of y'all were like oh my god I love the challenge and yeah this is my fucking show y'all like they're almost I can't take me serious with these glasses these are my glasses when I don't leave the house like nobody's seeing me but anyway so um yeah these are the final um and this is like the final, the final, like the challenge final of who's going to get the money. So, and it's over a fucking hour. I love that. I love that. So, that's what I'm about to do. I'm just about to put my wig on and I'm going to check in with y'all once I get done. And then I just got to go back to my P.O. Box because, okay, somebody else tweeted the other day. Y'all, look at my closet. This is going to be a whole different video. <sighs> Ooh, I'm just stressed out. So, anyway, but what was I about to say? Oh, she said that she sent me this cute ass outfit it's so cute y'all like it's so fucking cute and she said it's in my p.o box and i hope it's in there so y'all can see but i'm gonna go to my p.o box again so this is gonna be a big ass fucking p.o box unboxing honestly but yeah i'm gonna come back once this wig is on i'm not using glue i'm just gonna put this shit on and yes yeah, a nice ass day out today yesterday was trash but yeah let's get to it hey y'all so i wanted to end the video off with doing the unboxing so i wanted to do an unboxing for y'all y'all sent me so much stuff look at it. it's literally three bags full three bags full okay so we about to get into it and then also i did a little luxury purchase that y'all been wanting to see so i'm gonna show y'all that so i'm gonna show y'all that first I don't sometimes I don't want to I'm really like you know since I like unboxings personally I watch unboxings all day like I love luxury I love black women in luxury we need to make that a normal thing okay that needs to be normalized so but anyway so I just bought a little Louis bag that I've been actually um I just treated myself to a Louis bag because I seen this on Dana Alexa's story and I was like, bitch, I need that bag. And I don't know, it's just so me and my vibe and I love it. It's so luxury. I'm just going to show y'all. It comes in a box like that, like normal. And this is what it comes in. Oh shit, my battery is fucking night. Oh, you fucking joking. Okay, so this is the bag and then this bag is so fucking cute like i love it so much i love the color contrast i love the whites being right here as like a pop and then this patent leather i don't have a patent leather bag 
and Louis Vuitton is my favorite designer so I felt like I needed a statement bag from them and this one is perfect it's so cute it opens up like that and it comes with a strap and then yeah it's so fucking cute like and I want to get a red strap with this because there's this Chanel bag that I want and it's like patent leather too and it comes with a red strap and i want that that kind of vibe with this bag so i might get the red strap later and i still have the um plastic on it because i don't want to want it but yeah it's super fucking cute and this bag fits a lot of stuff so yeah and it has like the two little tags right here it's so fucking cute this is a statement piece like this is a bag this is a bag and then the top panel i love mini bags i love them my other battery was charged so we good so okay so let me just and y'all it's early in the morning it's like nine o'clock in the morning but i know i needed to get this in because i support y'all so anyway so this is the first box I need a box cover. Y'all, I've been getting so much stuff. I just been accumulating it because I wanted this to be big. So, ooh, what's this? Okay. Oh, it's heavy. So, this is what it is. This is from KK Cosmetics by King Crown. Cosmetics by King. Oh, well, let's see what's inside. I'll get that card back up. It's a whole bunch of lashes in here. Y'all be going crazy on the lashes. Y'all know I love lashes. I don't wear lash extensions really no more. And yeah, y'all be coming for it. Ooh, what's this? <gasps> y'all know I love body exfoliants. Oh my God, bath salts. Let's see how this smells. The packaging is so cute. Y'all packaging, y'all be coming through. It smells good like roses. Okay, body butter, period. Let me smell. Oh my God. If y'all could smell this. If I was a body scent, this is what I would be. It's like vanilla. It's Tatian vanilla. That's crazy. You can really smell like it smells so good without even looking at the scent period period what's this turmeric i know this is turmeric something oh it's body shimmer body butter this is what it is body shimmer body butter looks like that it doesn't really have a scent to it but I'm going to definitely be trying that out because I love making my body glow. Ooh, what's this? Bath Whip. I never tried this before. It's pink melon. I never tried a bath whip before. It smells like watermelon. That's crazy. How do y'all come up with this stuff? How do y'all come up with this? So good. But I'm most excited about this with body butter and then we have a body scrub y'all know i love body scrubs and it's just pink melon the pink melon and then what's this i think this has to be lotion okay we have lotion this is a whole body care line and i look for it and then we have hair growth oil and this packaging is so cute i'm not gonna open it because i wanted to i don't want it to spill but oh my god i cannot wait to use this i'm leaving this out mm. yes so oh and i'm gonna get in the shower too so i might so yeah so thank you so much cosmetics by king thank you so many fucking lashes so many lashes let me see. Ooh, these ones is popping. This one is Kush. Super cute. So make sure y'all go check out King's Y Cosmetics. That body whipped, that vanilla. Girl, that shit smells so good. I'm finna test that out today. 
because I love anything vanilla. I love vanilla coconut. If I was a scent, that's what I would be. Because it just smells so clean to me. Okay, this girl. Okay, it's some lashes. Y'all be hitting me up. So this is the J. Carter collection. J. Carter collection. She's so fucking cute. And then, oh, y'all really be what? Bitch, no. This is so cute. Who the fuck is calling me early? But this the packaging though, oh, like I said, I, what the fuck? Y'all really be coming through. This is, these, bitch. These lashes, wow. I'm gonna try these out today. No, no fucking lie. Oh my god. Thank you, Bay. Thank you, J Collection, and your packaging, bitch. This is so cute. Y'all be coming up with the best shit. I swear. Like our creative skills are unmatched. Period. That's why they always trying to copy us. Just stop, y'all. Okay, so this is cute. It's a bandeau top. Cute. So I'm gonna squeeze my tiny ears in this, okay? I'm not tiny. But um, <laughs> this black one is super cute. She wore this with like a um Nike tennis hat. It was so fucking cute. I might have to get on that wave. But yeah, just buy socks. That's crazy. This is a fresh pair of socks because y'all can see the crease in them. So, they not being used. They buying brand new socks. So, thank you so much. And this is their Instagram. Oh, you can um follow them on Instagram. V-I-X-X Studios. So, yeah. Thank you so much. Coco Girls. Period, pool. Period. This brown skin is that shirt you can't buy. Period. This is so cute. Thank you so much. Stop Coco Girls. Period. Period, poo. This is by Nor. Nor brand. What's this? Some clothes. Everything's black. I love that. Everything's black. Oh my god. This is so cute. This looks like the old BC BB shirts. Y'all know what I'm talking about? This is so cute. Oh, thank you so much. Okay, this is Too Chic Boutique. Too Chic Boutique. What's this? We'll love to see you in this. You will look bomb. Let me see what it is, girl. Ooh, oh, this must be a pajama set. They love pajama sets. And this material, I know when I put my lotion and stuff on, I'm going to feel real nice. Y'all know that out of the shower feeling after you get moisturized and your skin just feels so good. That's gonna be cute. Thank you. Okay. This is Lashes by Day. She says, hey girl, Kyra, I adore your YouTube channel. I wish you nothing but the best. I'm a small black owned business. If lashes by day, pronounce day. I know that. Thank you. <laughs> um, I sent you a lash D14 from our natural collection. Eyelash glue, wand, and scissors. Tweezers and eyelash curler. Enjoy. Can we get an update on the P.O. Box? Okay so cute i love the black on black that's really raw and then we have her lashes and then she has uh, lashes by day tips for application right up on here because some of y'all be asking me how to put on lashes and there you go step by step oh this is so cute a little lash kit so and i needed some new tweezers i needed some new tweezers oh my god i'm excited i'm putting this over here she gave me a whole kit of stuff. I never seen eyelash glue like this. I'm gonna try this out today. Thank you so much. And then here's the lashes. 
super natural, super cute. Cute. The last one in this bag. Oh my god, I hate when I do that. Boss moves, period. Y'all handwriting reminds me of the girls in high school. Cause I don't write like this. I write crazy. Dear Kyra, I absolutely adore you. Such a fly, intelligent boss. Thank you, babe. Keep grinding. You are the most consistent YouTuber vlogger I watch. I sent you products from my cosmetics line. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you, babe. So this is her grandeur luxury cosmetics. So this is her line. This card is so cute. It looks like a credit card that's cute you know gold platinum so let me show y'all so cute so let's see y'all know i love lashes <laughs> oh wait what's this i don't think these are lashes oh wait this is just her damn girl this shit wrap is oh my god this fucking packaging I think this is lip gloss. So cute. Oh my God. So cute. Thank you. Thank you so much. This is so cute. I love it. I love to see it. Wow. These are beads. Super thick and nice. I love it. Thank you so much. This is from Ashley. Thank you for taking your time to try out my product. Your appreciation for small business and your subscribers is not unnoticed. I hope you enjoy the items and clothes. Please allow your audience to use code. <gasps> There's a fucking bug on here. The code Kyra for 10% off their purchase. Ashley. Shop Josabelle.com. So we're going to get into it. That was fucking nasty. Ooh, so fucking cute. So cute. I love this. <gasps> but y'all, I gotta put nail polish on this stuff like this. Is this a bracelet? I've been wanting an evil eye bracelet too. Like a gold one. Oh, this is a necklace. That's so cute. Thank you. So this is the name of her brand. Y'all can go follow her on Instagram. And you can use my code for 10% off. Pretty. Super cute. Next, Minx Galore. Packaging super cute. Hey girl. She's super cute. Super cute. So this is her packaging. I have a love for packaging oh no tweezers period and then these are the lashes she sent me three bouncing girl super cute every time i look at y'all pictures on here i'm like brown skin girl brown skin girl thank you miss galore Thank you. Soap helps remove vaginal order. pH balance bacteria that causes BV or yeast infection. Girl, we be needing that, okay? We need our shit to smell fresh. So it's just a bar of soap. Super cute. <gasps> Shut the fuck up. These are so cute. Hey, Kyra, I love your videos and I wanted you, wanted to glue you some oh it says it looks like an l but it's a give give you some accessories from my business bella lux bundles i'm a black owned business and you inspire me to go hard and be a boss every day love dina oh thank you girl and these are so cute <laughs> oh <laughs> oh lord bless me these are so fucking cute. These scrunchies. And I'm about to get my micro links. So I'm about to definitely be using these. Oh my god. This is Fendi. Dior. Gucci. This one is my favorite. Gucci. And then another Dior. Oh my god. Thank you. Uh, 
I'm gonna love this. So cute. Oh, I'm so happy. Y'all love me. I love y'all. Let me post her Instagram. Super cute. And she got bundles too. So go check her out. Oh, I'm so excited about this. It's gonna be so cute with like a white shirt and some jeans and like your hair in a ponytail or something. Oh, cute as fuck. Okay, so she sent me some lashes. She sent me three. And I think this is lip gloss. So, oh, we love a good clear lip gloss moment. Because that's just what makes our lips popping. Popping. And she gave me three lashes. Super cute. And then some tweezers. And then what's this? Oh, a little cute pocket mirror. Bitch, I be needing it. So stush. It's a T. So stush. Thank you, babe. Oh, I'm excited. These are cute. She sells lashes, gloss, fragrance, hair, hair, lashes, gloss, fragrance, oils, all that. Like, period. Get your coins, sis. Get your coin. We love to see it. We love to see it out here. And y'all do not have to send no pink confetti, okay? Because this shit gets every fucking wear. Y'all do not need to send confetti. Hold that part. If it's in a box, yeah, but if it's just loose. So this is the next one. These is gonna be a number, bitch, because this is like that tattoo type of. <gasps> yes, like that mesh. I love mesh. This is cute as fuck. Oh, bitch, you did that, okay? And all the... I hope y'all don't mind my underarm. <laughs> but this is gonna be a number. Who is this from? There is no card. Okay, well, I don't know who sent this, but this is cute as fuck. This is so cute. Oh, it's a cute, oh, it's a little throw on bodysuit. Well, you don't have to throw it on. It could be worn so many ways. Thank you so much. That's gonna be cute when I get my body done, bitch. My hair's and shit. Period. Period, boo. Period. Oh shit, what is this? It come with some panties. These panties is cute as hell, bitch. This is exactly why I've been whitening my mother coochie so I can wear shit like this. Cause this is so cute. Oh my God, bitch. Y'all sending me stuff that I'm finna wear after my surgery cause I'm finna fuck it up, bitch. You don't even know. You do not know. Okay. Okay. That's cute as fuck. I don't know who sent this. There was no card or nothing. But thank you, girl. Okay, this must be for the skin. Because that's the before and after take two week challenge. Melanin skin. My brown skin glow system. Y'all know I love rose oils and all that. So this is her. Oh, that's what it's called. My brown skin period we love to see it so this is what it comes in i do not play when it comes to my oils for my face okay cleanse so it's a cleanser and then whoa 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 she snapped and i love the amber amber um packaging on like skincare or anything i think it looks looks so clean and luxury so she snapped so i think it's a spray so basically this is the toner so she gave me the cleanser and the toner thank you boo so make sure y'all go check her out 
Okay, so this is Code K. That's cute. Code K. Love a good mesh body suit. This is gonna be so fucking cute. Thank you so much. I love that cheetah suit. Period. Three more So this one is oh slate blue. These are my girls. These are my girls from the UK. The UK, the United Kingdom. They're the ones that sent me those pink sunglasses. Thank you. Thank you, Slate Blue. I think that's how you say it. I don't know. I don't know. But they sent me these two bodysuits. Oh, I love the neckline. I love a good um, high neckline. And then this is just my type of this is my type of vibe. Like it just looks so luxury. But yes, super fucking cute. And the material is bomb. And they sent me one in black. I'm excited about this black one. It's so cute. It reminds me of the ones you get from Zara. So cute. So luxury. I love it. Thank you so much. So make sure y'all go check them out. So make sure y'all go check out Slay Blue to get those. Um, buddy. So this is her card. Hey, babe, you looking good, your little body, and your swimsuit girl, okay? Period. Oh, shit. This shit is... This shit is a little raunchy, okay? So, I'm gonna have to wait till I get my body done, baby, okay? So, we're this. So, yeah, this is real cute. I really want to plan a trip, like, right after I get my surgery. Like, not right after, but a couple months after... I really want to like you know show my body off so this is gonna be something real cute and nice to show off and okay I'm gonna get the I'm gonna get them boys I'm gonna get them boys <laughs> them boys and that's something I never wore before that is something I never wore before but I ain't afraid I don't care I love being naked <laughs> oh my god so fucking cute these leggings, they look like workout leggings. Are these workout leggings? This is her card, her Instagram. So she sent me these leggings, super cute. These is cute as fuck. And they got the booty out, so they gonna make your booty look real cute. Like that ruching right there, cause it's gonna like frame your booty cheeks and just have it poking out. Super cute. Thank you. All right, y'all. Last bag. We made it. We made it. Okay. So these are lashes. Thank you, babe. Oh, she's so cute. Cute as fuck. Welcome to my beautiful roses. Tag all your selfies on instagram these are rose lashes oh she said get well soon this must have been when i know so it's covid positive cute packaging super cute i have to open this is oh wait it's just like that i'm stupid i thought this is wrapped oh these is cute like long natural lashes love to see it cute as fuck okay somebody sent me some oils I think this is some type of toner. There's no label on it. There's not even a name. And then she sent me some rose oil. Thank you. But there's no name. That sucks. These are just a bunch of lashes again. I'm gonna have lashes for days, okay? Bitch. These lashes I'm about to fucking show y'all. There's like, it's like, honey, I'm here. Honey, I'm gonna fly away with my motherfucking lashes. These look like fucking lash extensions. Like, thick as fuck. Oh my god. This is that. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to save these for a motherfucking day. What's your name, girl? 
queen the drama queen crazy ink and that explains the lashes and she gave me some high eye patches all of her lashes are super black and thick i like that so and that's why i think she calls herself drama queen and she also sent me some glitter i think this is like to use for like a photo shoot or something or if you want to be like extra so yeah that's dope as fuck so let me put her instagram on the screen go check y'all drama queen get your drama queen lashes because i think that's it. oh that's cute i'm not gonna tip it over but super cute Kyra, thank you for allowing us to send you some of our products. We hope you love our lashes just as much as we do. Okay, y'all. Uh, so I don't want this confetti yet. Yeah. No, just kidding. <laughs> oh my god, super cute. Super cute. Oh, y'all can use Kyra 20 for 20% 20 off. And these are her. Her this is her business card. Oh, I was so excited about this because y'all know I love brown. And she's a swimming Caroline. And she reached out to me. And I seen um, a couple of them on her page. Hey, Kyra, thanks. She has a nice fucking hair rating. Thanks so much for allowing us to send you over some of our bikinis from our collection here at Mesa Swim. We absolutely adore you and your YouTube videos. We know you'll look amazing in these pieces. Cannot wait to see how you rock them. Sending lots of love from the UK. My UK love us. Mesa Swim. Thank you so much. This brown one is what I was most excited about. I think I see my friend King in this. But this is her business style card. Super clean and nice. Super cute. And this is the Instagram. Super fucking cute. <sighs> this fucking swimsuit is so fucking cute. The material. Oh my god. This tag. Super fucking pretty. Oh my god. I'm excited to wear this. Y'all know I've been loving brown lately. I love like a neutral color. Super cute. Oh my god. The swimsuit and then the, this is the top. Oh my god. I cannot wait to wear this. Thank y'all so much. She sent me another one too. And then it comes in this like little cute travel swimwear package i'm definitely gonna keep this like i said i'm trying to plan a trip after i get my body down bitch i'm ready i'm ready to get the fuck asap okay that's so cute thank you so much she sent me a white one too let's see what this one looks like Ooh, super cute it's a little um bikini bottom <coughs> And then this top. Super cute. And if I was 10, this shit would look so amazing. <clears throat> but I'm like, because I've been quarantined. So I'm so excited about that. Swimsuit is so fucking cute. Ugh, I love brown. I love anything brown. Like this kind of tone. Super fucking cute. Okay, last one. Hi, Rug. Why is this envelope so cute? thank you thank you we love your channel here at shop t we sent you one of our two-piece workout sets hope you enjoy follow us on instagram shop t super cute thank you so much girl super cute i've been needing some new workout stuff too y'all Ooh, this is this is a medium it must stretch so um yeah super cute the material is nice. It's, I know this is going to be super tight to put on. And I need tight leggings. Because I hate when leggings, like, when I'm working out and they just, uh, Nike is not, it's overrated. Because that shit don't even stay up. Oh, yes. Yeah, super cute. <gasps> and I love this. I love when tops have the thumb out super cute thank you and then these two the backs out 
super cute and detailed i love to see it this is so fucking cute because i needed some new workout gear okay so love that thank you so much so that is basically it so yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog don't forget to like comment subscribe y'all can send me whatever you want if you didn't get the opportunity to send me anything um you can go ahead and check the description box below or it's my instagram um um bio so yeah you can send me whatever you want i love doing unboxings i love taking the time out to show black owned businesses because we need it out here sweetie and i love supporting and i love what y'all doing and we love to see it we love to see this shit okay so yeah y'all that wraps up this video i hope you guys enjoyed and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget to follow me on twitter because bitch we need to talk okay so yeah so i love y'all so much and i'll see y'all next video bye